One day I needed to be a little bit taller, so I headed down to Harbor Freight and I picked up this Franklin work platform. After using it a couple of times, I decided to make this video to show people how to make this platform safe. Here's the problems. Take a look at this leg here and compare it to the angle of this leg. You'll see the two angles are not even close. This problem is caused by the leg's latching mechanism. The latch is so loose and sloppy that it actually allows the leg to move by over a quarter inch. Let's take a look at this. We put the leg down and flip the latch over and lock it in place. With the latch in place, that leg should be firm and not be able to move. So try to imagine what it would be like to stand on this platform while you're working. Here's an absolute foolproof way of fixing this problem. There's four rubber feet on the bottom of this platform, and each rubber foot is held in by an aluminum rivet. Take your drill and drill that rivet out. Once the rivet is removed, you can now pull the rubber foot off. Repeat this process for all four feet. Okay, a quick check. Yeah, you still can't really stand on this thing safely. Now you want to carefully fold the legs in, making sure you don't pinch your fingers when you pull the legs back. Set the platform aside for just a second. Go outside and bring in the tool that will make this platform safe. At this point, your platform is 100% aluminum. So, here's what we do. Send it to the recycler. You are now guaranteed never to fall off this platform again. For this video, I went back to the Harbor Freight website to see how much I paid for that platform that was useless. I noticed they no longer carry it. Curious minds wonder how many lawsuits it took to get that thing removed from the market. Why Harbor Freight carried it in the first place? And why do they still sell stuff from Franklin, the company that made this unsafe platform? So please, everybody, when a fall from a few feet can easily kill you, think twice about buying ladders and platforms from a store that prides itself on cheapness. Well, thanks for watching.